Reggie Lau or Eva Reds, whatever you want to call yourself, I know about split personalities. I can get you some help. Now, Reggie, go with Phil. He's going to show you some light. Or Reg go with bad, and he can give you a different sight. I just want your soul to stay here so he can talk to Christ. I mean, I got to ask you. Reggie Lau, does this lower you stop battling a no name with no plan to have no lane? Man, I had to stop, start learning, thinking. I got to have better aim. I can't jump around and scream because most can't think with their brain. Now, I know I'm strange, but have you seen your mans? That's a Make-A-Wish Foundation with a sprinkle of not giving a damn. But this is his chance to show me the light before bad show Reg a different sight. Oh, alright. So you into that evil shit. So what kind of evil shit you into? Are you into that shit to see body parts get cut with a ginsu? Or grab a motherfucker's bottom half of his chin and rip that shit loose? See, I'm a zombie. That dead shit, that's something I'm into. I'm about to start bombing shit. So I can get shit clear. Wait, don't you even bomb shit to get shit clear? Well, this my year. And I'm aiming at all my peers. Because this Glock gets sentimentals. Your family going to be sentimental. I think the Lord just didn't send my mental. I know that was snow. But he know about that. Because that blow got that motherfucker's whole dome blown back. I'm about to black sun and wild out once I get on these stages. I mean, my wind's low. So, when this cannon fire, it won't miss your beam. You named yourself loud. You are not Dre Dennis's team. I mean, this D, E, well, C, U, youngin, you'll fly from the scene. I hate it when motherfuckers just don't catch the scheme. Because I'm wildin' out. And don't even have to be fly on the scene. I'm one orthodox. Like bangs when he does his dance. Or goods when he screams. But I love the spark shit. I'm a chef. This beef shit? Easy to market. Yow, yow. Wanna know what my weakness is? I plead the fifth. It's evil reg, I mean it. It wasn't shit you could have did to be prepared. I'm a beast, you bitch. You've never once in your life been elite at shit, and Oon is the doing H H O V and influence is not even a myth is bleak to him. You could extra hate underestimate me like a hella jealous neighbor who can't conceive the price of a mission and yet envision niggas is on an escalator. Niggas who try to pick bones never happen to be around when I was trying to excavate shit. So what you know about speaking in full sentences? The instant you were old enough to talk and still getting the shit beat out of you as soon as you was old enough to walk, I carry it with me. Like when you watch music videos and you could hear it in your head even when the sound is off. And I'm just sounding off. Because I'm so excited to share an environment with the first offensive lineman with no triceps. How insecure you got to be to hear Oon rap and then decide to strike an alliance? I wonder what you was trying. Because with the level of views he be providing, you get better promotion for your prior work if you were to simply try dying. Yeah. You Lil Wayne, potatoes and creatine instead of lean. You thought you was Kobe? Cause you got a rocky relationship with jelly beans. Let me be. I'm known for illustrating things in a way that's out of the box. And you look like that nigga from out of the box. I gotta be stopped. I heard Malcolm Jamal Rasta might bust a cap over pasta. And yet to me, he seemed like an oval team peace manga who reads mangas, an old Negro sumo league E Honda who rents a zip car whipping around with them green leaves posted all over his E Honda. I've been 30 before maybe. But you about to get 3000 Is it true? Everybody in the Pacific Northwest think you suck because your rhyme schemes are basic? Because to me, I find our feedback lazy. Because I can rhyme simple and still stay fly, nigga. But when you rhyme simple, I wonder, you all right, nigga? And my nigga, it'd be redundant for me to wig on you because you already look like Keenan with kale wig on you. But actually, 
I think it's slick how every time you rhyme, it sounds like an ad lib. And I'm a fan of how when you stand there, you got the swag of one of those man-shaped cactuses. And you whack, bitch. Thank uh you. -huh.